By now you've probably heard about Eggfinity. It's a cloud-based platform that stores all your data, right? Yeah, but there's a lot more to it than that. Here's three things you might not have known about Eggfinity. Eggfinity can store your data, and it can store a lot of it. All those files can be hard to sift through, especially if you have more files than just your own. Maybe you do data management for some neighbors, and everyone's data goes into the same account. Or you have a consulting firm, and you have multiple growers' data stored on your account. Regardless, it can be a pain to sift through the files to find one specific file. Utilize the Tags feature to quickly search for a file. Tags are automatically generated by the display and include anything from product used to operation to vehicle to operator. If you want to search for a harvest file, type in harvest into the search bar and all of the files associated with the harvest operation will appear. Maybe you want to search for your spraying files. Type in spraying and everything tied to spraying shows up. Between moving data back and forth and downloading this or uploading that, it can be kind of confusing keeping track of what files you did or didn't upload. If you navigate to the Support tab and click on Account Information, you can easily see details on when and where you moved a specific file, or viewed certain displays, or even when you activated licenses. This can help you keep track of things. One of the recently added features of Agfinity was Map View. Map View allows you to view your data anywhere you are. One of the advantages to using Map View is being able to see multiple years worth of data on the bottom in your stat cards. Right now we're viewing 2014 grain harvest. If I also wanted to view 2013 data at the same time, I would click on the pencil and select copy. This copies that stat card and creates a duplicate that automatically shows 2013 data. When I click on the map in a specific spot, the stat cards will update to show me 2014 data in that specific location, as well as 2013 data, to see if there's any correlations. These are three quick things you might not have known about Agfinity. To learn more about Agfinity, be sure to visit the quick reference sheets on the Ag Leader Knowledge Base.